What is up, Bread Gang? How are you guys doing today? It is a beautiful morning here at Caffeine and Octane, and I have a very special video for you guys today. I'm here with the man himself over there. If it'll focus, he's playing on his phone. We'll get with him in a minute. Love that guy right there, Lewis. You shout out to him. Link in the description below. Make sure y'all go follow him, El Morgallo, on Instagram. I have a very special video for you guys today. Yes, I'm wearing two jackets because it's cold and I'm from Florida, and I hate the cold, but man, today is, today is a huge day. You guys can tell by the thumbnail that, I mean, I don't even, I can't even talk. I'm so excited. Today is the 100% reveal for the new Tahoe on the channel. A cammed Tahoe with close to 600 horsepower. There's nothing more that you could ask for to start out with a build. And I genuinely have just nothing to say. I mean, one, I do want to start out by saying before we start the video out, huge shout out to Exact Window Tinting for partnering up today with me to get this video done for you guys today. If you guys need any window tinting done, anything, you let them know, you hit them up. Their Instagram is gonna be in the link in the description below. Hit Zach up, tell him Alex, that white bow tie, the bread gang sent you, and he will hook you up. He just did, a little spoiler alert for you guys, he just did the front windshield for me 35% and it turned out amazing it's perfect there's no imperfections he did a great job his team over there is amazing he's grinding just like all of us and I love what he's doing over there so if you need anything make sure to hit him up but let's roll the intro and get started with the video um she should be rolling up here in a minute I got a spot on the other side of the bow tie for her. man it's the first time stepping out together this is relationship goals this is a couple goals right here nobody does what we do and this I'm just I'm blessed and humble as ever, and so excited to share this with you guys. Before you guys even say anything, I just want to say there's like, I don't even know what to say. I'm still trying to gather it. Maybe a couple videos from now, I'll know what the first thing to say is. But yes, she did just buy this Tahoe. Yes, it is the new build for the channel. She's watching me do dumb things with my hands right now. But <laughs> yes, this is our new build for the channel and I'm beyond excited. I'm beyond just, I'm gonna do a full walk around with you guys today and really just reveal and show you everything that's great about this Tahoe. There's so many just amazing little things. A lot of stuff that came with the vehicle that most vehicles do not have and that really makes this Tahoe special and it's gonna make it very special down the road. And we're just, I'm just gonna jump right into it. To start out, 2017 LT Chevy Tahoe beautiful color it's like a champagne color i know up close it really kind of looks silver and which is really good but i'm really excited because it's like a gold and a silver thing now we got the truck is silver that's sitting in there dan's truck in the way though elegance. and it's it, it's it's got an elegance to it exactly it's it's a little girly for her instead of just the bland silver it's got a, a good little gold touch to it in the sun I'm really happy with the color, uh, happier than any other color probably. Start on the front, obviously it's got some chrome up front. Uh, no fog lights, but I think we might change that at some point. Got the projectors that of course we're probably gonna change again. Let me let me just say right now, there's so many things on this that we're gonna change at some point, so just, just bear with me. 
One thing we have already done is we did black, black out the bow tie last night. Um, that was actually a pretty quick fix for those of you that know the process of doing mine. You got to take the grill and all the headlights off. We didn't have to do that. You can literally just reach down inside, pop it out and pop back in. It was great. 22 inch wheels, 285s on it. Um, some tire brand I've never heard of, which is fine. It's four door. We'll, we'll get with the interior in a minute. What? Yeah, we did. Um, we debadged everything last night. So there's no emblems on the back, no emblems on the side, no Tahoe's on the side. I'm not really sure what somebody, I think it's just lowered in the back. I'm not sure what the deal is. The front might be the original stock height. I know the back is definitely, cause I, I mean, it's level. So it's definitely lower in the back than it was in the front, which is fine. I mean, it gives, gives the truck a great look right now. And we're filming right next to the Rolls Royce. Say hello. I had to film right next to the Rolls Royce. This is only right for the for the reveal of the. Ooh, all the doors open. Okay. All right, Dan. I know you guys remember a lot of this, but let's let's hop in. Check out the interior real quick. All all leather, black leather, beautiful. It's got the little brown accents on the doors. The inside is stupid clean. There's no issues, no scratches, no rips, no tears, no nothing in this. It is beautiful. Uh, third row seats in the back. It's got WeatherTech's all the way around. Uh, it is two-wheel drive. It's not four-wheel drive, but that is definitely okay. And sometimes I wish my truck was two-wheel drive, and techn technically right now it is. So definitely no issues with that. Heated seats that are going to be great at some point down the road. But I've un honestly just the inside is perfect. It, it's like my truck, but updated. And you get all the stuff, all the room in the back without having a stupid bed as well. Look at this guy. Look at that guy over there. Look at me. Look at, me. Look at him. Look at me. Looking at him. Do me a favor. Pop the hood. This is the best part about this. This. Tahoe the dealership had no idea you want to hold it. Oh, I thought that's what I was saying. You want to hold it So this is uh, oh Lewis and family are here. So this is the whoa. There's just so much stuff that happens around this shop It's just so this is the best part about this build the dealership had no idea so huge shout out to the dealership because They didn't know what they were they had no for. idea what was going on, but uh Hello, hi this is weird. I don't like you. Standing. No, I'm just watching. Don't. Yes. No, 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 no. This is like. <laughs> you want to you no, help tell go. the people no. what's going on with this Tahoe right here? It would mean so much more coming from you. What? What am I doing? Tell the people what's going on with this Tahoe. I just. Well, uh, you know, when they got it, it was really clean. We did a, we did a, we did a four six swap. You know, like a two hundred fifty thousand mile motor. Um, like she's making about making about two sixteen of the wheels right now. Uh, mild cam. That's all I got. I don't know. <laughs> that's, that's all I have. There, there's a lot of stuff that we don't know about this, and the dealership didn't know as well. So it does have a tune on it, cold air intake. Oh, just bring everybody. Bring everybody. Come on. Let's let's go. You want a small engine? Oh my goodness. Oh wow. I found the tweezers. It's a five three. Five three. Eight. It's a four eight with long tube. <laughs> It's got cold can in cold air intake. We're, it's got some kind of tune on it. I'm not sure what tune. So we got, headers. We've got long tube headers and a cam. I'm not sure what size cam, but it's big enough to need a catch cam. So there is a cam and a catch can on the vehicle and long tube headers. It's got the long tube headers are Cook's long tube headers, about 4,300 bucks from what I was just told. And then it's got a full $2,200 um, exhaust. $2,200 Corsa exhaust on it as well. So I mean, this truck came just ready to rock and roll. I mean, these these trucks come stock with about 480, 490 horsepower, and it's just put, it's pushing close to 600. So leave some likes and some comments below if you guys want to see us dyno this at some point. It'll be later on down the road. I'm not really worried about that right now. But from from the knowledge and research I've done, we're pushing about 600 horsepower in this Tahoe, and that's insane. That it's insane. It gets up and goes, baby. We get this fresh. Question of the day. Question of the day. To lift or lower? We are lifting this truck. Don't even know. Stop. <laughs> We're lifting this truck. It's a whole point. Okay. We're lifting this truck. I'm telling you, watching this right now. It's getting slammed. We're lifting the truck. Don't Bring even. Bring on the bags. Don't even. Bags right, to lift it. Oh, Lord. <laughs> yes. Nope. I really wanted to Oh, uh, the hood's open. Hood and the doors. All the doors have to be locked for it to remote start. Listen to that, listen to that. Oh, dang. Whoa. That's cool. That's crazy. This Tahoe 
is unbelievable. We still got so much to do to it. We got stuff that we're doing today. I wanted to give you guys a little walk around before we jump into what we're doing today. We're gonna take some more of the side moldings off. We're gonna take the lower valence off today. We're gonna take the mud flaps off today. And I think we're taking some of the chrome trim off the side of my truck today. So we're gonna hop into that and have some fun with that. There's so many people hanging out at the freaking, okay. at the shop today. Today's gonna be a really interesting day, but oh my gosh, we got a Tahoe. We're, we're revealing the Tahoe today, man. You guys gotta be excited about that. Learning as we go, aftermarket sway bars, it does have a two inch drop bracket kit and lowering springs on it as well. So that's how we get that leveled look. Just found that out. Hellcat motor and high flow cats. I mean, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. We got a steel. Super clean. Needless to say, I would love it if it was that tall, actually. Needless to say, we have just picked up the crown jewel of Tahoes out of North Georgia. I mean, I'm every every day that we spend with this thing, we're learning something new and learning some crazy, awesome thing that's either already been done to it or about it, or I mean, just, I don't think you guys can fathom just the ideas and everything that are running through. I think it's probably gonna stay low like this for a little while, but it's, it's definitely gonna get lifted. Dan is showing us the Rolls Royce lights that he's put on the headliner of his dually over here that they're working on today. The thing that I really like about the Tahoe is that it's got the, you know, a normal truck just has the two seats here, but the Tahoe's comes all the way back. And I think having those same lights running all from the front all the way to the back is going to be something killer. So I think that definitely has to happen. And in my truck too, obviously, but that's gonna be something different that I've never seen before. Okay, okay, enough fangirling about the Tahoe. We know it's great. They're gonna start working on some like debadging and stuff, but we've got all the badges off, but they're gonna get some of the mud flaps off, and I think they're gonna work on taking that lower valence off. But today I'm also, it's something I'm really excited about. We get to do dual vehicle vlogs now, so we get to work on the Tahoe, and we get to work on the Silverado now, which is so much better content for you guys. We are gonna work on trying to get, I'm gonna do this backwards, see if this will work. Hold on one second. Uh oh. Also gonna work on trying to get this ugly chrome molding off today. That is my project for the truck and her project for the truck is to clean it up and get all the badges off. So I will get back with you guys in a minute. Enjoy the cinematic montage of us working on the vehicles and just get excited for the new one. Looks like they're making good progress over here too. The mud flap off, a couple bolts and some 3M sided tape, or double sided tape, not bad. Making progress, I like it. Lewis has completely changed the game today. I, I lack a lot of knowledge in this area on how to actually do things to a vehicle. So we're, we're gonna do the real one, it's a old Is that my favorite? Yeah. Is that my <laughs> it, it won't work. I was using a credit card and some fishing line to get this off and he's completely leveling up the game for us today. I mean, that's just, that's what we're doing on the channel. Find new vehicles, learn new things. Blessed. Oh my God. Oh, what is this? You, you might want to move. What is, oh no. Uh -oh. <laughs> Josh and his girlfriend just showed up and Josh has got some new uh, 20 by 12s on the truck with some nittos. Man, that looks good. I think that looks really good on the cat eye. I'm super excited for Josh. I know he's got some, some trimming to do a little bit that's why he's up here, but we got the whole gang up here today. Great way to reveal, just bringing people together, having a good time, working on the trucks. Awesome, awesome day up here, but that looks really good. Got some ooh, little baby stance on it. I like it. Ooh, I like it. Let me, <laughs> there's so much going on today. We're gonna get everything finished up and then we're gonna have a big reveal of everything that's done today for you guys. A few moments later. Oh man, today has been a heck of a day 
full Tahoe reveal on the channel, new build, that's so exciting. We've got the Tahoe looking all nice and pretty, got it all cleaned up, got a bunch of badges taken off, a bunch of the side moldings taken off. It's looking really good, all cleaned up, got everything buffed and waxed and, and cleaned up just so there's no residue left over. We did it all the right way. We actually had some, some tools to use this, use this time, which was amazing, not having to do it all by hand as you saw at the beginning of the video. The Duramax actually started. Not done yet. I don't know if y'all could hear that, but he's not done yet. But last but not least, second on the channel now. Tahoe's done. We got all the side moldings off. Looks really good. I think it it's kind of clean. I like it. Tahoe, Silverado. Man, I'm gonna get these mixed up. This is this is gonna be bad. This is and this is where we come to the final conclusion of the day. And go follow the fam. Josh's Instagram is down below. Jordan's Instagram, Lewis Instagram, and of course this wide bow tie. If you don't go follow this wide bow tie, what are you doing with your life? Go follow this wide bow tie on Instagram. If you don't, you're doing everything wrong. Everything. But we're going to end the video off right there. Dan, you want to say it again? Nope. What? <laughs> Fine. No. No. You, you know what to say. What is, oh, let's get this bread. Let's get this bread. Are you going to focus on me? Is <laughs> Hello. Freedom underscore F150. Follow my man right here. We're not gonna do that today. Dude, it's pretty damn wide.